Hi everyone, I am Alros P. Munner, your nurse for this morning and uh, today we will perform a return demonstration of thorax and lungs. For the equipment, we need a stethoscope. Good day sir, I am Alros, your nurse for today and I will assess your thorax and lungs. By the way sir, what would you want me to call you? I'm Ali. Okay, Sir Ali, if you have any questions or concerns, do not hesitate to raise it so that we can stop and answer your questions. Is it clear, Sir? Yes. The first one is we will assess the patient posterior chest. So, as you can see, level ang kanyang shoulder, symmetrical ang kanyang posterior chest, and hindi siya nakaumbok di gaya ng mga karaniwang uh, nakikita natin sa mga taong may barrel chest. Barrel chest is having a broad, deep chest found on a man. The posterior chest of the patient is normal. We will place our thumbs over the spine or on the tent rib of the patient and then spread our hands over the thorax and instruct our patient to inhale and exhale. So sir, can you please inhale and exhale? Again. Again, again, again. So as the patient inhale and exhale, our hands is moving. So this means that the ribs of the patient is expanding, which is actually normal. Now, we will palpate the tactile frametus of the patient. A tactile frametus is a vibration created by sound waves. So, we will instruct the patient to say 99 as we palpate and also note the areas of increase and decrease of fermitus. So, I will use my palm to palpate starting from apex. Okay, sir. Can you say 99? 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99. Okay, so the vibration is normal or equal. We will take the posterior chest of the patient starting from the apex. Okay, so sir, can you inhale and exhale slowly? Okay, next, we will percuss the posterior chest of the patient starting from the apex of the lungs. Okay. So for the second one, we will inspect the anterior chest of the patient. Titingnan natin kung symmetric and in proportion yung kanyang katawan. Okay, so symmetric and in proportion yung kanyang upper body, and then uh, there's no any lesions. And for the second one, we will instruct the patient to inhale and exhale. Okay, sir, can you inhale and exhale? Again. Okay, so as the patient inhale and exhale, nag expand yung kanyang chest and sumasabay ng pantay yung kanyang shoulder. For the palpation of the anterior chest, we will start at the epicels going to superior lobe, middle lobe, and inferior lobe. So, we will uh, use the finger pads for the palpation starting at the epicels. Note any tenderness and also deformation. Do you feel any pain? No. Okay. So, same as the posterior chest, we will percuss the uh, anterior chest of the patient starting at the epicels going down. Now, 
we will isolate the anterior chest of the patient, same as we do to the posterior chest of the patient. So, sir, can you please be here and exhale? Same as the posterior oh. chest, we will also palpate the tactile fremitus of the anterior chest and also instruct the patient to say 99 as you palpate. So again, I will use my palm to palpate. Okay, so can you say 99? 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99. Okay, so, so the vibration is normal and it's and for the last one, we will record and document the results of the assessment and also thank the patient for the participation and cooperation during the assessment.